trans woman you want to be called her she whatever you decide even though you are a trans woman if you want to be called her she fine that i'm going to respect that and i'm gonna do i'm gonna do that so me as a woman if i say don't call me a cis woman i'm just a woman you should respect that i'm not no birthing person i'm not a chest feeder i'm not a bleeder i'm a woman and that's what the f you're going to refer to me as and you cannot ask for respect while disrespecting women and that's what the f we get for trying to be allies and shit. look now now they just trying to wipe us the f out now look at us we looking stupid dumb shit. hey i've been saying that y'all <laughs> hey she hit it on the head though, man. She straight hit it on the head. Like, look, now they it this whole thing is a just is a, is a is a is a swing at women, to be honest. And now they starting to try to they don't even want to call you women no more. They want to call you <laughs> They want to call you all these things that you not, man, and it's like y'all y'all gave birth to it cuz that's what that's what women do. They give birth <laughs> Hey, let me stop playing on oh, some real. Like, yeah, she's letting y'all know from the jump. This is just the beginning, bro. It's not even the beginning. It's re it's really been going on. This is just the the beginning of many frustrations that are gonna be opened up to a lot of people's eyes that thought this was cool. And that's all I'm saying. I can talk to. I can have one conversation with a guy now, and I know exactly what he's about. Okay. So most of the guys that have presented themselves in front of me just want to fuck me. Pause. I'm not interested. What else would they want Yo, to talk like, to See, this is, <laughs> this is what I'm trying to say with female <laughs> accountability. It is incredible. I've said before, and I'll say it again. If a woman sexualizes herself, the response from the general public is they're going to in turn sexualize her. All right? she posts on her Instagram is her in yoga pants, and she's Bro, known for celebrities. It's fucking incredible. What else would they want to do besides like, bro, like, girls don't understand that, like, your actions come with consequences. Fast money comes with slow problems. If you sexualize yourself, people are not going to respect you. When a girl objectifies herself, the man objectify in response. No man can objectify a woman unless she objectifies herself first, man. It I don't really ain't got nothing. I mean, it is what it is. Women want to put their self out here in a certain light, man, and they want to... Dave Chappelle said it best. Wouldn't it be confusing if me, Dave Chappelle, dressed up as a police officer, and then somebody needs some help, and they say, oh, Mr. Officer, thank God. We need your help. Oh, just because I'm dressed this way <laughs> does not make me a police officer. It's the same thing. So, you know, you're wearing a 304 uniform, you gonna get you gonna be treated like you putting yourself out there like that. You got your body out, you got your cleavage out, you got your 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 ass out, you got all this skin showing, and then you wonder why in other countries like women aren't even yet not even yet alone allowed to. They don't even want to show their body like that because we already know the primal instinct that a man's gonna have as soon as a woman starts showing skin. Like, come on, man, y'all gotta. We've been telling y'all it ain't it's not rocket science. There's no there's no secret to what we're saying. It just we giving it to you straight up. Either you're gonna take it or not. Eventually you're gonna find out it's the truth anyway. Because for a, at 40 for a woman, it's basically over. Really? Yeah. yeah. Having kids and like physically for most women, yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's exceptions, sure, but that's not the rule. But as a 40-year-old guy that like you know, if you're doing pretty well, like you could mm -hmm. get married tomorrow with a 25 year old, have five kids and still have a whole life. That's just not the case biologically for women. Yeah. Is it is it like, OK, 
I, I don't know about what she's talking about. Like, I, I know about what she's talking about, but let me go into context real quick. Is it really that point is where in 2023, do we not have the medical capabilities for a 40-year-old woman to safely have a child normally now? Is that not normal? Or is it just built into a woman's DNA where, like, you know, when she hits 40, you know, it's just super unsafe for every single woman just because they have, you know, the chromosomes that they have it just makes it unsafe. I don't get that. I understand, like, some women, it's, un, it's like, very, it's, it's, the risk goes up, of course, with everyone. As age goes up with anybody on anything that involves physical strain, you know, risk goes up, but... I would imagine if you live a pretty healthy life for most of your life, you exercise, you eat right, you take care of yourself, I'd imagine your clock moves a little bit slower. You know? Call me crazy, but that's, that's what I think, man. So what I think. It's my opinion. Call me crazy. Let me know. Are you friend zoning him? Yeah, we're just going to go out as friends from Okay, now. so you're turning him down because he paid? Because he paid or he... Or sorry, excuse me, because he split the bill. Yeah. But, okay, so you do have an issue if a guy wants to split the bill. Yeah. Why? I just think traditionally, like, a man should pay on the first day. You're not a traditional woman. I think I'm quite traditional in my own ways. You, you do OnlyFans. There's nothing, I, look, I, I have OnlyFans girls on the show. I'm, I'm fine with it. However, you're not a traditional woman. I think I'm pretty traditional outside of Are you a virgin? Pants. You said your body count, and look, I'm not shaming you, but your body count's 16, right? Yeah. A traditional woman is a virgin. Well, I disagree. That's not my definition of traditional. You How do you disagree? Oh. Listen, this is what people got to understand. Your personal definition of something that is another person's preference doesn't matter the person with the preferences definition of it is the one that matters so if you got a man saying i'm gonna be traditional with you i'm gonna pay on the first date my man's over here is right like are you a virgin Okay, let's say you're not even a virgin. Let's say you've, but you've had, you've had only just like one or two partners in your life. Okay, men could deal with that, but you've had sixteen. What's traditional about you? Look how you dressed. You got your stomach all out. You got you got this. What is this? What is that? What's this thing that they do right here? What is that thing? We not in Kemet. Egypt for y'all that don't know. We not in Egypt. What's going on? You going friend zone a dude because he didn't he didn't pay for the whole first meal? I got to pay 100%. I got to make a, a, a financial commitment for you just to get to know you? Bro, if y'all don't get off the drugs that you're on, I'm telling you right now, y'all about to have an ugly awakening, dude. These These... Man, these chicks are delusional, dog. They delusional. It's scary. It's not, it's not scary for us. It's scary for them. I, f I feel for them because this is all we see. And the the other, the majority of women are not like this. They're not like these women that you see. So it, it really hurts those women though because this is all that we see and so that men, men are now going to start thinking like yo women are just they've lost it they've gone crazy and they're bro the p stocks are going down and the d stocks are going up yo that's all, that's all i got to say it's new era i'm feeling quite bad so take another